guys. Turn up the car. I'm trying to vlog here. Go away. Another one? Go away. Can you go away? Thank you. What's up, guys? Ugh. How are you guys? It's Donna Bro back again. Another video. Today, first things first, 10 subscribers. It's a little late. By the time you're probably seeing this, we have 11 at the moment. I'm sorry I'm a little late. School been tough, okay? But I'm bringing it back again for another video. But here, ugh. We're doing something you haven't seen today. Let's just say, eh, you know, one of my kind of sort of hobbies. Now, whenever I started this, as you can see, I got a big lump right here. You know, it's kind of sticking out. Yeah, it's a gun thing, uh, but not a real gun, obviously. I'm not able to carry one. Airsoft gun, as you can see with the tip. It's an airsoft pistol. But if you think this is it, I said it's right here. If you think that's it, it's a moss. Yeah. So we're just gonna be shooting a target, which I have forgotten. Oops, oops on me. Ugh, put that down there. Yeah. Oops, sorry. Camera angle. Go back inside. Uh, we gotta fix that. One second. Oof, okay, back. Got a beanie. It's cold out. It's like 40 something. It's like 41 degrees. Ugh, got my target. The moment. I'm too poor. To, can't afford my own. No, I'm joking. But at the moment, it's just a box with the thing on it. Don't ask why. I don't feel like getting my actual one out. And it's so basically, I'm shooting to that lake. Well, that's going by that tree, and I'll be shooting right down here. Either, sorry, either pouched up with muffle moths right there, or running around with my pistol. I might do a little bit of both. Either way, lots of lucky out today. Just, we just got like, like at least two inches of rain or something. So everything is covered in water. You don't believe me? Look. That's not the lake. That's the lake. That's just extra water from rain. Jump. Ugh. My tur not my turret, my target. Pouched up right there. Yeah, so basically, all I gotta say, if you guys want Go subscribe, go like, go comment. That'll mean so much to me. Go share this video with your friends so we can get more subscribers so I can do more things. Next big thing will be either at 25 or at 50 subs. I don't know if that'll ever happen. I hope it does. That'll be a lot. And yeah, guys. So if you want to see more Airsoft stuff, leave a like below. Comment down what you want to see me do with Airsoft. I might go to an arena. I might do a first person with it. I don't know. You'll have to see. you have to wait to find out. Either way, I'm going to get set up. I'll be right back. Ugh, back. So I finally got finished setting up, which took a couple minutes. Now we're going to actually start shooting stuff. Ugh, get my flamaz out. Oh, come on. This thing has metal parts built inside, so it's kind of heavy. Ooh, not really, though. It's just the gravel and stuff is being annoying. Uh, pose that up. Uh, here we go. Should be on single file. F file. Single fire, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, it's on single fire. I see my target. Turn off the second safety. I guess you right here. Oh, shoot, right there. Secondary safety. And my hands are getting freezing. Oh, shoot. Water's, or the ground is, as I said, super wet. It's freezing cold. It's 41 outside, and my pipes and water. Not a good combination. I think I'm gonna sit for this one, though. Ugh. All right, I want you guys just in my leg. So there goes my target right here. I just showed you, secondary safety. Yeah, flick that. I like flicking it. That way, just cause you know, 
it's easy if I'm over here, I can just go like that and done. And then when I'm just doing this, I just go like that. I'll explain the gun in a minute. Take a shot, bro. Oh, yeah. I'm an idiot. Didn't rub up the mag. You guys don't know. Always gotta rev up a mag, this, the uh, fully auto gun mags, or any mag that has a rev on the bottom, as you see right there, as the rev. I'll get into this gun more in a little bit. Here we go, now we can do it. Oh, heard that one. Ugh. Pick you up, let's go check it out. Heard that hit the box somewhere. I aimed right in the dead middle, but bar or barrels lower than the sights are, so probably won't have, won't have hit it in the middle. Oh, let's see. Any area where, where did I hit it? Maybe I just hit it, didn't go through. And I don't think it went through yet. Dang. Oh, that's where it hit. So, right here, you guys probably can't see it, but. Right there, that's where I hit it. Now you guys can saw it. So the gun long range, kind of accurate. It has, it has a spread. That's a single fire though. I'm gonna rev up the um, ugh, gun in a second to its full and go full auto with it. And sprint around my yard. Yeah, I'm probably gonna get muddy, all that water and stuff. Probably get muddy, but hey, it's worth it. Ugh. I'm gonna rub up this thing again. Revving it. I think it should be revved up to its max right now. Full auto. You guys can just listen to this one. Okay, so yeah. I'll get into it in the middle in a minute. saw that one hit so wind right now is not that nice not being nice to us but i found the hit of it hit or miss no i'm joking but found it found how it goes Ooh, i already see one hole at the least i think should be a couple So another hole right there. That's not the first one now. Uh, where'd they go? What? I swear I just saw them. I shot. A, I shot a lot more than that. I saw them bounce off. Okay, you guys aren't gonna leave me. I promise you. I saw it through the barrel. I watched it hit the center of the box. Okay. Yes, I know. I know you're gonna say no. You didn't. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. I'm sorry. I did. I watched it. If you hate, I don't care. No, I'm joking. Please don't hate. Well, I'm joking, though. But that is uh, still fire. Now I'm going to try running around. Ugh, firing this one-handed while holding on to a camera. Okay. You guys ready? Or that go through. I hope it actually worked. Um, yeah, I'll get into that gun in a minute. Then I'll get it, and then I'm gonna fire my pistol, and I'll explain it all in a minute. Ooh. Let's see. Right here. Oh, we got closer. I see some dents. You guys see on the seven? Dent in there and a dent in there. Dent there and there. Oh no, my knee! Free my knee! Okay. Either way, did that. Now I'm gonna fire my pistol. And I'm second. Said we'll go inside. And I'll explain everything in a minute. My pistol, though. Oh shoot, can't turn it. I can carry you single-handedly. Like, gla, gra, gra. <laughs> 
saw that. You saw the smoke come out. That's H two. Uh, not H two O. Just shoot. I forgot what it's called. Um. Uh, I don't know. Either way, that's its power that it does. Uh, that it uses. If you guys know what it's called, put it in the comments. I completely forgotten. But heard some more damage gone to it. Oh look, another hole. Right there, another one. Now there's three there. I definitely heard some more. I don't know where they all went though. So then you go inside and stay. Nah, none stayed. None, none stayed. And now that you've seen each gun, go inside. I'll explain the guns to you guys. And yeah. See you guys. In one second. Back inside. Shady. You want out? Huh? Okay. Personal business. And now you guys are stuck with me. Haha. Uh -huh. No, I'm joking. All jokes aside, here we go. These are the guns. These are the guns that we have today. It's a classic pistol with CO. Is it CO2, I think? Yeah, CO2. Uh, pistol just single fire but it is a nice blowback which here if i set you guys down right here you guys can see all its properties in detail it's a nice blowback it's a nice sound when you fire and now it's on safety so i can pull the trigger all i want there's a safety on for it and then whenever you're out of ammo, which is actually cool about it, it goes back and this thing it comes up so it makes it, you know, look like it's out of ammo. You slide it down to get rid of that. But here, right here. I see right down there. Press that. Oh, crap, we got my mag. Wait, mag comes out. Now put the gun down. Mag, it says 13 or something. I can put 14 in it without it without it falling out down here. It's a nice mag, I'm metal, except for the bottom, bottom's plastic. Um, it shoots actually really well. Uh, I think it's like 350 with uh, 12, so it's probably around like like maybe 300-ish, maybe 275 with .20, which I, oh shoot, or no, maybe it was 350 with .20, I don't know, it's a really good gun. Okay, either way, straight in like that, you fire away. Well, that's that gun. Bring you back over here. Here's the FAMAS. Now, FAMAS, I'm gonna set you guys over here for because I need both hands for this. So, here you go. Okay, so, ugh. here is the FAMAS I was telling you all about. Really nice FAMAS. Another blowback. It's nice sounding with it. Oh, shoot, I didn't turn the safeties on for these. Bad by me. Oh, shot it too. Either way, it has two safeties, or yeah, two safeties. It has this first safety right here, which I'll get into that in a minute. But first, let me talk about the gun itself. The gun itself it's kind of has a bit of a spread to it, but it shoots probably around the same my pistol does, unless it's 400 something. Uh, I, wanna, I heard some, someone told me it was like 420 or so, or not 420, oh my god. Now I'm going to get stuff in the comments. 425 FPS with .20. Um, and, yeah, so you have a barrel. You have, I mean, you have the classic barrel, which is made out of metal, except for, and except for that part. And it has this weird adjustable thing. If you guys know what it is, put it down in the comments below, because I actually do not know. But I got to put this up. Ugh. Here we go, see? It goes up and down. Turn it around so you can see. You just have a button right. You got a little button right there. You press the button down. You move it down or up. I'm going to put it back down. Just because I think it looks best down there. I don't know what it is for again, as I said. Ugh. It needs to get tuned in with this. I don't know. Well, it just does not feel nice with that. Anyway, and then if we go up to the handrail, you can carry it like this. And then you have this, um, ooh, one of the iron sights right here. Right here. Let me see if I can move it closer if you can. Okay. 
See the iron sight right up here, which you can move side to side and adjust it however you would like. Let's see if I can get it back. Okay. Then right here, did you see? Oof. Right here, you see the scope. The scope itself has two different things right up here where it's going down. You can put it up, makes it smaller. Here, right in the front here. It's another smaller, but I think it's a little. I think that's smaller. Yes, yeah, so you have a smaller one in the front and a bigger one in the back. I, and then if you put them both down, you have this big, oh, huge one at the start. Oh, my cousins are coming. Gotta finish up. Um, yeah, I'll tell you guys some. Uh, er, here, here down here, you got a mag. You pull out. Nice mag. Down at the bottom, it said rev mag. You had to rev it up in order to fire with it. it. Takes a good couple revs to get it going. Oh yeah, yeah, it's like my, you know, my Wi-Fi blinker. Oh shoot, now it's pitting out bullets. Not supposed to. Eh, probably because I was holding it down or something. But you're supposed to rev it like this. The way it goes into the gun, it's kind. Of, I don't. I don't mean. It's cool. It's not my favorite way. But you got to put it. Here, see if you guys can see it. You got to go like this. And then you put it in like this, and then you twist. Not my favorite. And then you gotta push up a bit. Not my favorite. Now let's get to here. Yeah, yeah. A pull out. It's pretty nice. Said barrel. Still has an adjuster thing. I don't know why. Then we get down here. This is your safety. Right here, see? I honestly can't pull down, I promise you. Over here, you fire. Same with on this side, if you're lefty, you still can fire. But that's not all it does. If you go like this, and up more, this front piece right here, you go, I whipped out the battery. Yes, it's electric. Why would it shoot fully out if it wasn't? Don't ask me. I don't know, unless it's a spring. It's a, I don't think springs can do that anyway. Either way, it's a battery. See, the battery goes up here. You unplug it by pressing down on the thing itself and pulling it. Charge the battery. Charger's over there. I'll get into that in a minute. You charge your cable. You put that back up there. Now, uh, when you first get it, it'll have a weird thing right here. That's kind. Of, it's kind of like a foam thing. You got to pull that out in order to have the battery to be able to slide straight up them DMs. And I'm giving the slide in and fit well. It's made to come out, so if, if it leaves marks and stuff, don't worry, it's made to come out. And then, as I said, you put that back up in there. Um, and I'm, I'm, I'm not, but that's how you would do it. And then you gotta push it down in, and then when it's actually in, twist back. See, when you twist it, you gotta put it up. You'll hear it, I like, watch, whenever you twist it here, Makes a small noise, but then when you go like this, it pops. That's how you know it's ready to come out when it pops. And then down at the barrel, the back of here, not adjustable, which I'm really, I'm kind of okay with. Uh, but right here is the barrel. See its modes right here. It's on off, and then it has single shot and full auto. I'm putting it on off so you know I don't shoot. But even if you do have it on anything other than off, this still protects it. Then you have this, which I don't know what, I think it's just the looks, but it doesn't go on the back. You have to get the bolt off. And I'm not gonna do that because, you know, I don't really feel like doing something with the bolt. And then up here, which I kind of like about the gun. So on a normal gun or, or on a normal FAMAS, whenever you need to pull it back, or I don't, I don't remember what it's for exactly, but you put that there and it doesn't make it, go, it stops you from going all the way back there. It still has that. It's kind of cool. The only thing I way I would think about it is if you're like, I don't know, this kind of sound kind of sounds dumb, but if you're like aiming in like this, you can kind of peek over almost like a grenade sight or a grenade launcher sight. Okay, that that goes up fully rotate fully rotates, and then back here, another thing with the gun, um, it's it, it is, oof, it's um. 
I don't remember what it's called, but you just quickly you pull this off. Ugh, if it won't work. You gonna do it, please? So I can show them? Here we go. You have your, um, I don't remember what it's called, your UP. Or, I'm I probably saying that. I'm probably not. I'm probably, that's probably not what it's called, but. You have this little dial here, which you twist to increase. I think it's fire rate or something like that. I don't know. But it goes on and off with this piece, which is made, it's made, I'm pretty sure, just to look nice. But, you know, I mean, it has a little hidden thing with it. Still pretty cool. Now, if this will go back on, and hope I didn't break the gun, because I'm pretty sure I did not. Oof, okay. Um, maybe this side will work. Please just don't tell me I broke it. Oh no, okay, I didn't break it. It has a simple click feature. It's kind of weird. I prefer it the other way around though. I think it's better like this. Uh, no, actually I do think it goes on that side. It definitely, it's a lot better. Or does it? You guys probably can't see it, but I'm messing with it. Okay, I, I, I think it may go on the side. I don't know anymore. Yep, there you go. I heard that click. Okay, so it does go on this side of the gun. Or sorry, that side, not the other side. Either way, the, gun, the two guns that I have so far. Either way, I think they're really nice guns. I gotta put the battery on the charger. I'll show you this. It's just a normal charger. Sorry if you hear talking in the background. It's a normal charger. Just normal. It's a cord, it's a cord like the same thing in the FAMAS. It has this with the clip on it. It's right here. See the clip. Simple plug up. Now, your charger might actually work. The one I got doesn't. It always says red. Don't ask why. I actually do not know. Just does. It's kind of weird. But, yeah. So, if you guys did enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe. If you want me to do more stuff in the future, I will. I'm hoping to be able to do a new gaming thing, a new gaming video. So, yeah. If you guys enjoyed, as I said, like, comment, share. Sorry. Like. Comment, share, subscribe. That one on the hate it. No, I'm joking. That's 2016. Still, so, don't care. Like, like, comment. Oh, I keep messing it up. Like, comment, share, subscribe. If you subscribe, you have to dab. Dab on the subscribe button. Okay? Do it with me. Ready? I bet. No, I'm joking. But do it with me. Okay? I'm being dumb. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, comment, subscribe. I've said this so many times now. Just have a good day. See you guys later. Bye.